Hello and welcome guys to Deception. In this video we are going to understand how to calculate the final percentage for the ICSE class 10 semester 1 board examination results. So make sure that you watch this video till the end and if you like it do hit the thumbs up button, share this video with your friends and subscribe to our channel at Deception. Also ghanti dawa dena hamare sare videos ka notification pahunch jayega. Guys, before beginning, let me tell you that Eduception has covered a lot of videos for ICSC class 10 semester 2 examination. So make sure that you subscribe to the channel and go through all our videos. I hope they will be helpful. Now without any further ado, let's begin. Say for example, your results look like this. In English language, you scored 36 out of 40. In English literature, your score is 34 out of 40. In second language, that is either Hindi or Bengali or Assamese, etc., your score is 38 out of 40. In history and civics, you score 32 out of 40. In geography, 38 out of 40. In mathematics, 40 out of 40. In physics, 31 out of 40. In chemistry, 35 out of 40. In biology, 33 out of 40. And in group 3 elective that means either computer applications or commercial applications or economics applications you score 45 out of 50. So how to calculate the final percentage using the best of 5 method. Guys the final percentage is not calculated based on this. First we have to aggregate the marks for a few subjects. So let's do that. The first subject is English and English is the combination of English language and English literature. So for English, we will have the average of English language and English literature. So we will get 36 plus 34 divided by 2, which will be 35. So in English, you will have 35 out of 40. Coming to the second subject, that is second language. That means either Hindi or Bengali or Assamese, anything. So second language is a single subject. You have scored in second language 38 out of 40. So the score will be 38 out of 40. Then we come to HCG. HCG is history, civics and geography. It is the combination of two subjects, history and civics and geography. So let's find the average. For history and civics, we have 32. Plus for geography, we have 38. So plus 38 divided by two, that is 35. So in HCG, you have 35 out of 40. So 35 out of 40. Coming to the next subject, which is mathematics. Mathematics is a single subject. In mathematics, you have 40 out of 40. So you will have 40 out of 40. Coming to the next subject, which is science. Guys, science is a combination of three subjects. Physics, chemistry and biology. So let's calculate the average for P, C and B. So we have 31 plus 35 plus 33 divided by 3 which is equal to 33. So for science we have 33 out of 40. Now finally we come to group 3 elective that is either computer applications or commercial applications or economic applications whichever exam you have taken. So guys as you can see that for group 3 elective that is either computer applications or commercial applications or economic applications the marks is out of 50. So what we will have to do is we will have to convert this marks into out of 40. How to do that? 45 out of 50 so 45 out of 50 simply multiply it by 40 so into 40 0 and 0 gets cancelled out 5 9s are 45 so 9 into 4 that's 36 out of 40 simple enough so how to convert to 40 whatever marks you have got just multiply it by 40 so we got 36 out of 40 so 36 out of 40 let me rub this out now over here we have got the aggregate of all the subjects now we can easily find the best of 5 final percentage now guys, in the best of 5 final percentage, English is taken compulsorily and rest you find the best of 4 subjects. So first of all, let me write the marks for English which is 35. Now let's find the rest best of 4 subjects. 
so as you can see the highest marks is in mathematics which is 40 out of 40 so plus 40 then after mathematics we have second language that is Hindi that's 38 so plus 38 after 38 we have computer applications that is 36 so plus 36 and finally we are left with HCG and science in HCG you have 35 in science you have 33 so we take the best one which is HCG which is 35 so plus 35 so over here you have the marks of best of five subjects English plus best of four simple to understand now this will be divided by the total marks so we have five subjects so 5 into 40 the total marks are 200 into 100 so let's find the final percentage simple let's add 35 plus 40 plus 38 plus 36 plus 35 that's coming to 184 divided by 200 into 100 so what do we get divided by 200 into 100 so that's 92 percent so as you can see guys for your marks the final percentage from the best of five method is coming out to be 92 percentage so i have taken a very simple example over here based on this example you can find your final marks based on the best of five method so guys i hope you have understood the process it's quite simple now after using this process please let me know your marks in the comment section below and guys before ending i would like to say one thing that even if your marks are bad or your marks are good tension mat lijiye semester 2 abhi bacha hai acche se padhai kariye and i believe in semester 2 you will score amazing marks so guys don't be tensed at all you will score amazing marks new videos on reception are coming very soon so stay tuned until then this is rishi on behalf of reception signing off and guys take care